Welcome back to the Mountain Morning Show. So, Joe, do you ever find yourself on vacation wishing that uh, you didn't have a gym, but that you had some exercises that you knew of that you could do easily? Yeah, I guess. You know, yes. I, I've done the sit-ups in the, in the sit hotel room before. The sit-ups and push-ups. Push yeah, Can so do there's, that. there's a couple of those that definitely work. Well, we have a Jennifer Rabbi who sent us this video. Like I said, she wasn't able to make it on uh, during Sundance because of our shows, but uh, she sent us this video to give you some great ideas and insights into some awesome ways that you can you know still stay fit and get that energy that you need of course from exercising while you're away whether it be on you know vacation or business travel what have you here it is Jennifer Raby uh, Pilates instructor Hi, I'm Pilates instructor Jennifer Ravi, and if you're like me, when traveling or on vacation, you want to stay fit, but sometimes you just can't make it to the hotel gym. That's why I love these five Pilates-based ab moves. You can do them anywhere, your hotel room, outside, even an empty conference room. All you need is a mat and some space to move. So let's do it. Okay, we're gonna start sitting down and then we're gonna roll ourselves back onto the mat. We're gonna bring one leg up to what's called tabletop and then the other leg and we're gonna start our warm up with the 100s. We're gonna breathe in for five counts through our nose and then breathe out for five counts through our mouth. We're gonna keep our arms very strong as we reach our shoulders away from our ears so we don't look like this. And we're gonna keep pumping those arms and warming up the body. If you want to have more of a challenge on those abs, you had a late night last night want to de-bloat yourself you're gonna reach your legs long and breathe good keep going for ten more good and last five four three two one very nice we're gonna just take a little breather good now we're going into single leg stretch we're gonna flex off the mat we're gonna take two hands on the outside of one knee stretch the other leg long take a breath in and breathe out and switch good this is called single leg stretch this is great to stretch out the tops of the thighs if you've been sitting in an airplane for a long time good exhale as you reach the leg long keeping the stomach strong shoulders down good and we reach feels really nice on the legs and the abdominals very nice now you're ready for an extra abdominal challenge we're going into double leg stretch we're going to breathe out as we stretch our arms and legs long keeping the stomach strong and then stretch through the upper body come back to your start position if you need a break like i do <laughs> just put your head down and then regroup inhale prepare exhale we stretch good inhale good four more for four and three thinking navel to spine again if the leg movement with the arms is too much of a challenge just do the arms or just do the legs whoops <laughs> I did both I like the challenge obviously good and then moving into scissors we want to stretch out the hamstrings great after a long day of skiing or sightseeing we're gonna just take a little tug on the back of the thigh exhale you can relax the head and the neck if you're feeling strain in your neck put a little hotel pillow under there if you need to good as you feel a nice stretch in the hamstrings and the hip flexors all the while keeping your stomach strong good exhale remember to breathe and breathe good now coming into oblique twist this one you get to rest your head on your hands and inhale prepare exhale we're just going to rotate our, our ribs to our hips and then come back to your start position and other side good this is good if you have extra love handles from having too much fun on your vacation exhale really tunes right into your oblique area your waist good if the leg movement again is too much just stay in tabletop or you can even put your legs down uh, exhale and good now coming into my favorite one we're gonna take a little shell stretch and just relax the neck and the back and breathe good if you keep all these Pilates moves during your vacation and your travels, your core will thank you for it and your trainer will too.